Yeah, this whole block is boarded up. This just used to be all retail. Wraps around the corner, the whole block is boarded up. A lot of trash on the ground. Close now. Yeah, that corner building is really looking in rough shape. A lot of trash. You can tell they haven't opened this door in a while. There's the sign. <laughs> Good luck with that. Not here. We're in Los Angeles, California. A very well-known city all over the world for the TV and movie industry. Thanks to your support and your comments, I'm out here exploring the retail devastation that had no exception for this city. I'm going to walk on Broadway Street one of the main city streets. I'm just going to press record and I'm going to let the video do the talking. Let's find out. Here's a retail for lease available. This used to be a flower shop. Here's another one for lease. 1800 square feet. Retail space for leaves. Here's the COVID hotel, in case you're into that. This used to be a pizza place, LA pizza and more, gone now. This right here used to be El Pollo Loco, all boarded up now, gone. Sad to see these high-end restaurants for lease available here, right on Broadway. Here's another one right next door, back to back. Here's another place that's available and boarded up. Boards, boards, boards. Right next door to it, another place vacant. This one doesn't have any for lease signs you can tell it's completely empty and it's a large retail space so right next door same thing i think this is a one big store the whole thing right next door here's another one really run down empty store right in downtown A few dogs. The tags are all ran down with rain. Here's another space available. There's the sign right up there. This used to be a boutique. Bridal dresses. Closed now. On this block, the only place that's open is that market food place. Right next door, there's another one that's vacant. All of these used to be retail spaces. Now they're boarded up. They're not even available for lease. They don't have any signs, nothing. This used to be a Mexican place. You can tell it says there. It says uh, carne asada, which means steak gone now look at this entire building it's entirely every window is boarded up and fenced up dirty looking building here that's where the signs used to be up there nothing now and it looks like it's been like this for a while you can tell this is old and it wraps around the corner, this building here. All the shops on this side are also closed. Nothing left. These were all individual shops that are now closed. That's where all the signs used to be up there. Nothing left. All gone. This one here says that it's for lease. There's the sign up there. For lease. All of these here are bacon stores. 
completely empty. And right next door to these shops, more retail for leaves. This is for sale. Yeah, this is another large retail space that went down. There's the name up there. It's for sale, any takers? Yeah. Here's another one. And another one. And another one. Moving ready. I don't think they're ready. Not yet. Give it some years or decades. DTLA Chamber of Commerce. Should be called Chamber of No Commerce. That's much better. Next door, same thing. Available. So that makes this entire block all vacant and right across the street another place available this one was called party time now party time is over boards next to party time another one and next to that another one all vacant retail spaces really run down over here this one too. This one's the same one. Store hours. Monday through Sunday, nothing to nothing. It never opens again. Close now. 10,000 square feet of retail space available on Broadway. This is 455. These entrances right here have been boarded up. Well, the whole building is being boarded up. Let's see the name of this one. This one was Falas Paredes. Whatever that was. Close now. The building across the street, also closed. That corner, also closed. So on this intersection here, there's only a convenience store that's open on the corner. The other three corners are all closed. This one's closed. That one's open. Let's get across the street. This big one here in this corner is all closed and boarded up. So is the next one. Close. So yeah, on this intersection, the only place that's open is that convenience store in the corner. This one here is closed. That used to be a Falas Paredes. And this here, this used to be a Walgreens retail pharmacy. Go now, and now it's available for lease. A big, retail pharmacy here on this corner everything's boarded up now and across the street that used to be Rite Aid close now another one in, the, in this corner everything's boarded up and this closed recently you can tell it's not tagged yet here's another shop that has seen better days now it's all run down. I hope this wasn't a crypto.com office because that would be disappointing. Same block as the Rite Aid. This shop is closed. This one is boarded up. Another bridal place. So it's the next one. Gone. Even theaters are not surviving now here. This one's gone. Right next door, also closed. Retail next door, right, right next to it, all boarded up. 
and gone. Right next to it, you can tell they broke the glass on that door. And it's for lease. This one's also gone. So is the next one. You can tell there's nothing in there. Oh, and it does. This one does say for lease out there. For lease. This one too. Right next door. For lease. These ones are large stores. Here we have a spot, a coffee spot that's open. But they broke the glass. That's unfortunate. The only place that is open, they vandalize it. Next to it, everything else looks closed. This one's closed. The next one's closed. This one is just closed for the day. This one's closed. You can tell everything on this corner is closed. There's the uh, for lease sign up there. And there's some uh, street vendors right out here on the sidewalk. And all these places look like they're for lease. There's a sign up there. Same thing across the street. All that looks like it's vacant. Here's the Los Angeles theater. It doesn't look open. There's nothing on the marquee. It looks really run down. It must be closed. Nothing there. Yep. Nothing. I, I thought at least the theaters were open. This is all closed. This one right next door says for lease up there. The Palace Theater also closed. Nothing on the marquee. All dark inside. <coughs> really nice place. At least it's clean inside. And then all of these shops are closed. Right next to the uh, Palace Theater. So the for lease sign for these places was up there, but they tore it down for all these retail units. The one next door, same thing, closed and round down. There's nothing in there. It's a lot of trash. You can tell they haven't opened this door in a while. Same thing next door. Everything's closed. Now we're on the corner of 7th and Broadway. That says for lease there, but I can see that underneath that's Burlington. And that's open, so who knows why that says that is for lease. Maybe upstairs somewhere. All these places here are just closed for the day. And here 7th Street for some reason is all blocked off. Maybe construction. But it looks really bad. These places too, these are just closed for the day. There's somebody, maybe from the city, just cleaning all the tags. Must be a daily routine here. How often do you have to clean the tags? It was a never ending um, cycle sometimes. Never ending, huh? Yeah, sometimes we'll clean one block. They move to the next block and we clean that block and they just go over and over. And by the time they be back where we start. So it's an, an everyday thing. It's almost here. Wow. Yeah, but it's, it's coming together though. Well, I will agree on that. Okay, that's so, good to hear. Yeah. For now, it's job security. Well, yeah. That too. <laughs> <laughs> All right, man. Have a good one. Right, Thank you. Go. Here, the man. It's almost every day they got up. They have to paint over the tagging. Here's a place that's open. Everything is on clearance. Everything must go. I remember this used to be an arcade place back in the day. They boarded up way up high. See how tiny that is where it says up there for the first 10 minutes. You can't read that when you're driving. Very deceiving. Here we have two places back to back. This used to be a Mexican food place and this here used to be a cafe for lease. Here's another apparel store, gone now. All empty and brown down. Nothing in there. Right next door, for lease. All empty in there. At least it's clean too. There's the uh, For Lee sign up there. And that Globe Theater right across the street. 
That looks close too. Right next to it, it has a sign that says for lease. It says restaurant for lease. Now we just got to 8th and Broadway. This used to be a Adidas store. Go now. There's a for lease sign up there. And across the street, same thing. Close and boarded up. That whole block is boarded up. This was the Adidas store. This whole block used to be retail. All closed. The entire block. And it wraps around the corner too. That corner too. Retail or restaurant for lease. You can see the sign up there. See? Wraps around the corner. The whole block is boarded up. A lot of trash on the ground. Close now. Right next door to the Adidas that's boarded up. The building next door too. It says for sale or for lease. This is the other side. All boarded up. Now this is the corner of 8th and Broadway. That saves me some words. I don't have to go for lease, for lease. Everything is just closed. <laughs> this here is right next to all those boards. This is the part that is on board, but it's vacant. You can tell this used to be a retail place. It doesn't have any signs, but it sure is empty. Right next door, it's empty too. The doors are boarded up. This place is all boarded up as well very large spaces sometimes there's multiple spaces all closed and boarded up boards 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 every time I visit this place here in the corner this is a block away from Broadway this is Hill for leaves these are individual units they're all closed and it wraps around the corner all closed there's the uh, for lease sign up there. And right across the street, that corner too, for lease. Here's another space for lease. And yet more, restaurant retail available for lease. There's a sign up there. This here looks like an apartment building. But next door, for lease. It, this is another one retail or restaurant available for lease Two back to back That's an empty lot This one is a uh, An available place This one is an apartment building Up here people live up here and here for lease Next door to it for lease Now we're on 11, and this whole corner building, and the one next to it, for lease. Look at the size of this corner building, all vacant. Vacant building. It's this entire block, all vacant. This block too, the entire block, all for lease. These are all retail spaces available. There's the contact information. Everything in there is empty. This is a retail slash restaurant space available. Right next door, this corner here, also vacant and available. This corner one is really large and it's next to the one I just showed you in the previous clip. All of these across the street too. All that is for lease. Here's another one available. And next door to it, another one available. There's the sign up there. This one too, for lease. It's sad to see downtown LA in such a bad shape. 
on my first day here. Let me know in the comments what you think about LA, visiting different cities. Always check the description for additional information and I'll see you on the next video.